Hi everybody, my name is Chelsea and today we're going to be reading the book Today I Feel Silly and Other Moods That Make My Day. Our theme this month is renewal and I'm going to tell you a bit about why I'm reading that story with the theme of renewal after our story is over. Today I feel silly. Mom says it's the heat. I put rouge on the cat and gloves on my feet. I ate noodles for breakfast and pancakes at night. I dressed like a star and was quite a sight. Today my mood's bad. I feel grumpy and mean. I picked up my room. It still isn't clean. I forgot to feed Franny and water the fern and the cocoa I'm making is starting to burn. Today I'm angry. You'd better stay clear. My face is all pinched and red ear to ear. My friends had a play date. They left me out. My feelings are hurt. I want to shout. Today I am joyful. My mood is first rate. My friend's sleeping over. She said she can't wait. My freckles are popping. The sun is so bright. I ran in the relay with all of my might. Today I'm confused, my life's getting hairy. Sam says he's my boyfriend, but he also likes Mary. My mom told my father he might be a dad. He, yeah. My mom told my father he might be a dad. I might get a brother. I'm not sure I'm glad. That even surprised me while I was reading it. Today I'm quiet, my mom understands. She gave me two ice creams and then we held hands. We went to the movies and then had a bite. I cried just a little and then felt all right. Today I'm excited. There's so much to do. I'm going to sell cookies and lemonade too. I'm starting a club to go clean up the park and I've got a big crush on my teacher named Mark. Today I'm cranky, so nothing seems right. I have diarrhea and broke my new kite. My mom dyed her hair orange. My dad shaved his beard. My tooth came in crooked. My family is weird. Today I'm lonely. I feel so small. My auntie's away. I wish that she'd call. My mom's working late and my dad has the flu. And although I've got stuff, I've got nothing to do. Today I'm happy, I'm walking on air. I learned how to knit and to French braid my hair. I did my first solo in hip hop and jazz. This day's been so great, I'm full of pizzazz. Today I'm discouraged and frustrated. See, I tried rollerblading and fell on my knee. I really want straight hair, but mine's curly Q. Should I cut it or grow it? Oh, what should I do? Today I'm sad, my mood's heavy and gray. There's a frown on my face and it's been there all day. My best friend and I had a really big fight. She said that I tattled and I know that she's right. Today my mood's great, it's the absolute best. I rode a two-wheeler and passed my math test. I played soccer at recess and we won the game. I sang in the show when my parents both came. I'd rather feel silly, excited, or glad than cranky or grumpy, discouraged or sad. But moods are just something that happen each day. Whatever I'm feeling inside is okay. How do you feel today? And that is the end of our story. So the reason why I chose that book with the theme of renewal is because this. So renewal means that something can be changed right you can do something one way and then change it to another you can decide maybe you're going to renew um, yourself by getting a new job or maybe you're going to be renewed because um, you went to school and you had a bad day at school but then when you get home maybe your parents made your favorite meal and so then you're happy again so I read this book about moods because our moods can be a sense of renewal, right? So we can start and feel one way in part of the day and then we can feel a different way later on. So I know personally, I wake up, I'm not usually in a very good mood when I get out of bed because the baby tends to wake me up a lot at night. So I wake up and I'm usually crabby and my eyes are half closed 
and I think, oh, I just want to go back to bed. I do not like this day. But something that really helps me feel renewed is if I can sit outside for just a minute and maybe I'll take my drink outside first thing in the morning and I'll listen to the birds and I'll see the flowers and I'll take some deep breaths in the fresh air and then my mood is renewed. So instead of staying grumpy and crabby the whole day, then I am a lot happier when I step back inside. So just keep in mind that your mood does not mean that it has to be that same way the whole day, but it can always change, you can always change, and maybe it takes taking a moment in a different environment, so whether that's stepping outside or going to your room, or if you've been in the living room and you've been crabby there, maybe just like stopping and going into the bathroom for a little while and closing the door and just taking some good deep breaths in the bathroom or wherever it is that makes sense for you to um, just take a moment to yourself and think about what might you be able to do to make your day better. You can always renew your day. So that's why I chose that book today. I hope that you have a wonderful day and I'll see you next week.